Where are my soul sisters? Let me hear y'all flow, sister. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, your sister, Union in the house today, and I'm so happy to see you guys. It is pretty bright up in here. I did switch up a lot of my furniture, so that's why we are here at a different angle. But excuse me if I'm like, squinting because of the sun rays so today i'm going to be sharing must-haves for the summertime and we have products from skincare to deodorants and even foot sprays so stay tuned in all right guys so this is the very first product and definitely this was a product that i didn't need to finish it to realize that it's a great product as soon as I put it on, I knew I loved it and I introduced it to Derek and Derek absolutely loved it. It's not like my foot smells too much or anything like that, but in the summertime, you know, we do sweat and let's be honest, we do smell some type of foot odors, you know what I'm saying? So for that, this is so helpful. And as soon as you put it on, it does contain peppermint oil. So it smells so good and it's really refreshing. And Derek does have this like specific skin concerns of sweaty hands and sweaty feet. He almost like didn't go to the army because it was so severe, but he did anyways, like, you know, and they made him like hold a gun, but he said it was so slippery and he still does have concerns of that like every time I hold Derek's hands it's pretty sweaty and I don't mind it but he's always like oh is it okay you know isn't it sweaty and things like that but for someone like Derek or even for anyone in the summertime I feel like this is the product that everyone needs to have on their vanity or in their back it helps to promote sweat evaporation of the sweat it also has penthanol and betaine ingredients to moisturize the feet as well and in CO Bigelow in New York which is apparently the oldest pharmacy in in America with a long ass history of 180 years. This foot spray is also sold there and it's also sold at Lopes offline stores throughout Korea. And the how-to is super simple. All you have to do is spray it on your feet and you can spray it up to your knee area because it is a foot spray. I don't advise you to like, you know, spray it like on your chest or like everywhere because it does have such a cooling and minty feeling and it's long lasting too so sometimes when it gets really hot i get tempted to like spray it on other parts but because it's a foot spray you just have to spray on up to your knee and after working out or after a long long walk Derek and i love spraying it on because it really helps to ease the fatigueness and it just feels really good and also you can put it on top of your stockings or on top of your socks personally for me I like using it for prevention as well so I spray it a little bit on my tennis shoes before I wear it especially during the summertime I think it really helps with prevention and definitely this is one of the best discoveries that I've had for the upcoming up summer I'm so happy for that oh and one of the points that I do have to mention is that it does contain propylene glycol so if you're not good with that ingredient you should not use this product and anyone that has problems with allergies before should definitely double check the ingredient list all right guys so let's move on to the next product now it's really difficult to find a good moisturizer for the summertime the reason is because there are so many good products out there uh, with such a light fresh textured gel type of uh, you know like moisturizer cream however after three to four hours or even shorter time i've noticed that my skin feels so dry maybe it's like lacking some ingredients or maybe it's just that for my dry combination skin it's not enough or maybe it's because i sweat a lot during the summertime whatever it may be i find it extremely difficult to find the moisturizer that hydrates your skin, but that has a refreshing texture, you know, that will not like clog up my makeup, that will not feel too rich, you know, on my skin. Because during the summertime, the biggest thing is that you don't want to put anything too rich on your skin, you know? Anyway, so with that said, this is such a great moisturizer for the summertime. This is the Robectin Skin Essentials Aqua Concentrate. It's so hydrating and the hydration lasts for the whole day. And I love that it has a light, gel-like texture, perfect for the summertime. I know that for those of you that live in hot and humid countries as well, it's really difficult to find a good uh, moisturizer that will help to hold in that moisture for the whole day. So I feel like this will be a great choice for you as well. It absorbs quickly into your skin and it's very gentle and it's suitable for all skin types. This cream only not hydrates, but it helps to brighten the skin tone as well. You can't really see that effect right away, but I think after about a month or so, I saw my skin tone just being really bright 
brightened and my uneven skin tone became very even as well and it does contain niacinamide for that brightening effect and it does contain different types of hyaluronic acid not to just hydrate the surface area but deep within your skin Derek doesn't have any pads oh my god Derek Hi! Hi! All right, guys, so the next product is the Medicube Zero Pore Pad. I had to add this to this video because this is definitely my go-to when I start seeing blackheads, when I start seeing sebum like on my nose and around the T-zone, around here and here, and that is pretty darn often in the summertime. But I don't want to use anything too harsh on my skin because I do have sensitive skin and I do want to effectively get rid of the sebum and tighten my pores and care for my pores. But at the same time, I don't want to use a product that is too strong because it will irritate my skin. It will damage the skin barrier as well. So this product I only use on the T-zone and I love it with the passion. This is something that I saw really good effects with, especially for my pores. And I feel like pore care products products are um, a category where there's so much room uh, for like uh, better products and for improvement you know because it's it's really a difficult concern um, of pore tightening because you can't really see like a drastic results right off the bat and things like that and this one is so good I love how gentle it is but at the same time how effective it is it really helps to remove the impurities and sebum and dirt away uh, from your pores and at the same time it does have patent ingredients to um, tighten your pores as well and this product is in a pad form so it's super easy to use it does contain 70 pads so you can use it up for a very long time I wanted to show you this method that I love after making sure to sanitize my scissors with rubbing alcohol I make three small cuts on one of the pads for the nose so they can stick onto the curves of my nose really well when I was planning for this video this product was definitely something that just automatically popped in my mind because whenever I see a little bit of something going on with my pores this is like something that I reach for right away so I feel like you guys will really like this and it's very effective um, I remember I used it with um, the serum it has a like pore zero serum as well that combination together is really good also so please check out the video because I share about the uh, serum as well in there but anyways if you do have pore concerns blackhead concerns and enlarged pores or clogged pores I feel like just those two combinations will be really good or even just using this pad will help a lot all right so the next product is actually a deodorant and deodorant also is a category that has a lot of room for improvement like you know what i'm saying especially in korea when you walk into olive young and you walk straight to the um i was gonna say armpit section the deodorant section there's only like five selections and they're all Nivea, like the spray type, the powdery type, or like the whitening type or this type. Like there's not many selection of like deodorants, especially in Korea. And I can't recall too much in the States either when I used to live in the States, like in, when I was in junior high, high school and elementary school. But I still remember that there weren't too many choices of deodorants either. Now I'm sure it's different, you know, because that was like years ago. But I still remember there was like Old Spice and some from like Dove or things like that, right? Please let me know in the comments below. But anyways, so this is a deodorant that I actually liked and that I actually wanted to repurchase. Before, I don't think that I had many choices and I had to have a deodorant because I didn't want to smell down there, but this is something that I really liked buying. And as I was paying my money, I, I felt like it was worth it, you know? This is a very first deodorant that I felt that way. Um, this is the Pharmacy Freshen Up All Natural Deodorant Stick. And this is amazing. I've been using this for about three years now, and I recently bought two off of coupon. This is such an amazing product. It has a cooling effect too. First, when you put it on, it feels a little bit moisturizing. And then after about a few, like I would say 10 to Two seconds after you dab a few times it becomes powdery so I really love the finish and it does have a hint of cooling sensation it's not extreme but it does feel really cooling 
and it smells very minty. And this product is vegan. It's also free from baking soda and aluminum. It does contain papaya, which is a really good gentle brightening ingredient that helps to reduce the appearance of discoloration. It contains um, cowl and clay, which draws out like the surface impurities and absorbs the wetness of your like armpit sweat, you know what I'm saying? And then it has moringa, which helps to purify skin by removing impurities caused by pollution or external stimuli. And this is actually made in Korea. A lot of the products from pharmacy is actually manufactured in Korea. So if you check that like in the back, you will see that often. Um, but anyways, this is sold at sephora.com, on eBay, on Amazon, uh, overseas links. So I'll link it in the description below. And I feel like maybe the con about this deodorant is that the um, sweat prevention is not as strong. I feel like it's great as a daily use, but if you are looking for something that has a stronger effect with like the preventing of the sweat, I think um, this will not be as strong, but I feel like for daily use, this will definitely be enough. And yeah, I'm really glad that I bought two so I can, you know, stock up on this so I won't smell on my armpits every time I go like this or something like that. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys, so we're going to move on to the last product. And I know you guys are sad that it's the last product, but no worries, guys, because I'm going to have a lot of different videos for the upcoming up summertime. I want to recommend products uh, for different categories for the summertime so that I can help you out before you make your purchases. Um, I will do a separate video for sunscreens. I've been meaning to do it for such a long time, but I feel like uh, it was really difficult to find something that I like, like 100%, you know, because I feel like sunscreens as well is a category for something that there's so much space for better products as well but any calzies so let's move on to the last product and this is the BioWish Trend Quad Active Boosting Essence and I'm actually planning to make a summer kit with Wish Trends and I have not confirmed the selection of products yet but this is definitely on top of my list if you have um, acne prone skin if you have sensitive skin even oily skin types combination whatever it may be and I didn't even say the name yet this is the BioWish Trend Quad Active boosting essence so the name is essence and it is supposed to be used after your toner and then you're supposed to use this and then you're supposed to use your serum but for me personally I use it as my toner step so right after cleansing I use this uh, as the very first step of uh, skincare and I love the way that it soaks into your skin quickly this is especially amazing for those of you dealing with acne or blemishes as well this contains willow bark extracts which is really great to fight acne it has cornflower extracts which is great for skin regeneration and my favorite propolis extract which is well known and loved for its healing antiseptic effects and yes i'm planning a rocket deal with wish trends uh, for a summertime kit so stay tuned in for that as well all right guys thank you so much for tuning in until the very end i really hope that you found this video helpful please give me thumbs up like subscribe follow me on my instagram it's the same thing uni on me i will have more giveaways coming up so stay tuned in okay i love you guys so much and i'm praying for you and your loved ones so i hope that you guys can do the same for me i love you guys and i will see you in the next video bye my unicorns Annyeong! bye bye